Ben 10, Ben Roos and Go Go Hamsters. Yes, it's that time of year when us adults need a nudge in the right direction to make sure there are no disappointed faces on Christmas morning. To give us that nudge, uh, Wendy from John Lewis is here, who's going to give us a brief on the top toys to ensure that Christmas is tear free. Oh. Welcome. Hello. Are we going with traditional toys or are we sort of all these electronic computer generated things that I know nothing about? Some, t some children will want to go for the electronic toys like the Game Boys, things like that. But we do a lot of traditional toys, which we find a lot of children still like, like the grandmas. Is it, is it the children that like them? Yeah, or do parents, parents that like parents to buy them for their children, or grandparents <laughs> like to buy them for their grandchildren? Well, when the children come in, they're always playing with the traditional toys, like they'll go for the doll's house and they'll go for the Hobby horse. Hobby I horse used to have a hobby horse, a hobby and horse. it had a bell. Dink. Yeah, <laughs> my wife had a hobby horse and it had little wooden wheels on the bottom and she'd like run, around, run, around, run around the house. It did. Not that I was there at the time, no. obviously, no. clearly. <laughs> uh, but she reliably informs me that that's what she did. Whereas my children, I mean, the list we read out there, some of the, some of the toys. Ben 10. Ben 10, ben no 10. idea. Oh, no he's a cartoon that character, isn't he? Yes. He's a kid's would, would, that, would that be, if I had do boys, would that be more oh, relevant? Yes. I hate to be sexist about this, but toys <laughs> are like that yeah. sometimes, aren't no. they? What's a benderoo? <laughs> the benderoo? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, even she's flummoxed with that one. Okay. What um? What will people re What what will kids be writing on their list? They desperately want that that, that mum and dad yeah, be queuing up for every Christmas, isn't there? There'll just be there's lots there's lots to choose from this year, and there's like our top ten. There's lots from there, but obviously a lot of children will be wanting from the remote control cars to the dolls, prams, yeah, things like that. So price wise. I don't know how much we should spend on kids. You should know this. How much do we spend as on As little children? as possible, yeah, I find, yeah. generally, is the Nothing. best way to go forward. But, but let's it's sort of go, for example, a big doll's house like yeah. this. How, how much is that? Something That's like that. forty nine ninety five, yes. and then you have to just buy the little bits of furniture to go Oh, isn't with that it? always the way, though? Forty nine ninety five <laughs> buys you the box, and then it's like a table's about ten quid, yeah. and two chairs is another <laughs> ten quid. And oh, he's so, so, so cynical, isn't he? You know, we were talking about how being grumpy is good for you the other day. You have to observe things like that and get it right. But, you know, having said that, I'm not being crazy, because then the kids can get little bits and excess for birthdays and yes. spend their Christmas money on it and they can make a real thing out of it, or can't they? friends could buy extra, they can buy yeah. little things to go in the house as well, like the dolls or the kitchen. You mentioned this uh, Brio. Bri is this Brio train yeah. set? No, that's our own train set. Forgive me. Brio it's along the same lines. Compatible so. with Brio, yeah. I have no idea. <laughs> Other train sets are available. That, that is as bad as traditional as it gets, isn't it? A little wooden train set like that and they, they connect by magnets. I mean, presumably that, if you've got your own version of it, it does very well, I would yes. imagine. Yes. You can, you can buy all the accessories from Brio, which will attach to that. Attach to it as well. Yeah. So we've got, I have to say, these are quite girly presents. What do boys like if we're going down the traditional route? Traditional route for the boys. Can you still they get like Meccano? Can you still get Meccano? As long as you can still get Meccano. Can you yeah. still get um, Scalextric? Lego. Scalextric. Yeah, good. Lego. These scooters are huge, aren't they? They have been yeah. for years. So I think they are. I mean, they're probably, that's probably quite... Expensive is it? How much is that's that? That's 89.95. Yeah. But I would think that's worth every penny because I, I know that children do use those they a lot. They use them a lot and you yeah. get outside and they get some exercise and you get a bit of peace and quiet on Boxing Day with Exactly. You like. Did you see last night, um, it was the plasticine chat. Are we still allowed plasticine? Is that still cool? Well, yes. it depends whether you want it walking into the carpet. <laughs> yes, right? exactly. I don't have children. I don't care. I buy them drum sets and everything. <laughs> Next year, you're the hand that buys the gifts that the parents are really filled. They get like, here's a trumpet. Thanks. Thanks. And yeah. there's lots of price range, though, because these go-go hamsters. Can you tell me what a go-go hamster is? Are you familiar with go-go hamsters? It's, so you just wind the hamster up and it just go... And it, and it go just, goes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Ten quid. That seems reasonable. Whereas your Sylvanian family's caravan. We've got a lot of Sylvanian, car Sylvanian families at Crane Towers. Three daughters. Did you? Forty-four ninety-nine <gasps> is quite yes. expensive, isn't it? It is, but like you say, you can get other people to buy bits to go with, can't you? So some yeah. some games enjoy a resurgence in popularity, though, don't they? And just there's lots of accessories for the Sylvanian families, so they love all the different ones that go with them. Terrific, okay. fabulous! Terrific. Thank you very much. Well, may I be the first to wish you the compliments of the season? Thank you for coming in. <laughs> no, Thank we're you. not doing that yet. <laughs>